South Africa experienced a 16.8% decrease in full-year earnings as consumers cut back on distinct discretionary rather purchases amidst rising living costs. The company's headline earnings per share dropped to 352.3 cents for continuing operations, while group turnover and sales fell by 16.4%. Additionally, the final dividend per share decreased by 23.9%. Investment analyst Jal Pabulia shares insights on Hulwood's recent financial performance. Woolworths released its year-end results today. The result was on the softer side and this was characterized by tough trading conditions, high interest rates and severely strained consumer disposable income. Given the lighter performance, the dividend for the year was also 15% lower compared to last year. While lower promotional activity supported price movement, the fashion, beauty and home operations were negatively impacted by poor availability, which was due to port congestion, as well as the late onset of winter in the second half of the year. Nevertheless, performance in the food division remained quite robust, and this was reflective of brand, brand excellence. Woolies Dash and the on-demand service drove online sales, which was a highlight. All in all, the group expects trading conditions to remain quite tough, but remains confident in its ability to deliver against strategies going forward.